Paul said to the Corinthians in 1 Corinthians 3, I planted, Apollos watered, but God gave the increase. So then neither he who plants is anything, nor he who waters, but God who gives the increase. Now he who plants and he who waters are one, and each one will receive his own reward according to their labor. Now when we began, there were no Calvary chapels in San Clemente. There were no churches being planted at that time in San Clemente. We plowed, we planted, and now new churches have come in and they've watered. And God gives the increase. But here's what Paul says. Paul says we are all one in the spirit. You can't water a crop unless someone plows the ground and plant the seed. You can't have a harvest until those who have planted and plowed have done their job. Those of you that know that, that what it means to plant and plow, you know that that's the hard job. The easy job is watering. Anybody can come in and take a harvest. Anybody can come in and water the ground. Anybody can do that. It doesn't take any skill or anointing to do that. But to plant and to plow, that is where the hard work is. And the Lord spoke to me when we were at the pastor's conference this year and said that Calvary Chapel, San Clemente, has done a good job plowing the ground and planting the seed. You guys have done a good job doing the hard work. God has given us the grace to do the hard work. It didn't seem hard at all. It seemed effortless as we've just kind of done what God has called us to do. And although we may not see all of the increase, we are one with those who are because our job has been to plant and plow. That's what our job has been, to plant and plow, and we have done that. And others have come and reaped the harvest. Others have come and, and you say, well, how is that all connected? Well, that's, it's all connected through the kingdom of God. That's a kingdom of God mindset 